So far, we have assumed that goods are infinitely divisible. And with well-behaved preferences, I could have a nice looking indifference curve like this. Here is a bundle on the indifference curve where I am consuming 1.4 units of good 1 and 0.7 units of good 2. Now, what would happen to the indifference curve if one of the goods were not infinitely divisible? A good that is not infinitely divisible is sometimes called a discrete good. Let's say that, for example, good 1 is discrete and and let's say that the consumption of good one can only be an integer. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and so on. Well, the bundle that I have marked up is no longer available. Our consumer can no longer consume 1.4 units of good one. She can consume 0 units of good one and 2.2 something units of good two that would be on the indifference curve. One unit of good one and slightly above one unit of good two would be on the indifference curve. Two units of good one and slightly less than 0.4. And finally, three units of good one and slightly above 0.1. These are the only four possible bundles on the initial indifference curve. She is indifferent between these four bundles but all the remaining bundles on the original indifference curve must be removed. So this is an indifference curve when good one is discrete and preferences are well behaved. Note that we lose this important concept of MRS when goods are discrete. There is simply no way of defining a slope given just a single point like this. However, you can still use the approximation. MRS is approximately equal to delta x2 over delta x1, as long as you pick delta x1 equal to an integer value. This will make it much more difficult to analyze the two goods model and the consumption choice. And this is why we, in general, tend to assume that goods are infinitely divisible. We can also look at the weakly preferred set to a bundle when good one is discrete. Remember, in the general case, when both goods are infinitely divisible, given a bundle like this and an indifference curve through this bundle, the weakly preferred set to this bundle was this collection of bundles, including the indifference curve. So what will the weakly preferred set look like for any of these bundles on the indifference curve? Well, let's focus on this one. From this point, I cannot move to the left and I cannot move to the right, since good one can only be consumed in integer quantities. I can only move up and down as good two is infinitely divisible. Due to strict monotonicity, we know that if I move downwards, I must end up with a bundle which is worse. If I move upwards, I must end up with a bundle that is better. So all bundles on this straight line will be strictly better than the bundles on my indifference curve. And they are part of the weakly preferred set. The same is true if I start with a bundle where I consume two units of good one. Here are strictly preferred bundles to this one. And here are strictly preferred bundles. Same thing over here. Draw a little bit on the bundle with zero units of good one. The weakly preferred set in the case when good one is discrete is this collection of broken straight lines. I cannot add a point such as this one to the weakly preferred set due to the discreteness of good one. So let's draw what we just did a bit nicer. A good is discrete if we cannot buy any arbitrary number of units. We assume that we could only consume an integer number of units of good one. Here is the bundle where we consume two units of good one and some amount of good two, which can be any real number. Here is a bundle where I consume zero units of good one and I'm indifferent between these two bundles. We can also consume one unit of good one or three units of good one. The indifference curve in this case is the collection of these four points. In this example, there is no fifth point as the 4,0 bundle is viewed as strictly worse than any of these four bundles. As long as we remember that an indifference curve is actually a set, an indifference curve consisting of four points should not be too upsetting to anyone.
The week preference set, the collection of all bundles that are weekly preferred to the X1, X2 bundle is the collection of all bundles located on any of these blue lines.